we drive in, we see the Wizards and all the wonderful work that the Wizards guys that does. Now we move over here. Where are we at and what's happening here? This is this is the cutting table. This is where, like Julio explained to you, the, they make the patterns. Okay. He gives them the patterns. The ladies actually spread them on the table. You know, it depends on what materials they're choosing. Those patterns are like on the side of the, the Corbin logo, everything, it's taped up. Yes. That's what they call the patterns. Then the ladies uh, spread, stretch out the piece of metal, the, uh, the leather, and then they actually put the patterns on there and then cut them out. And then they number them, either A, B, or put letters on them, A, B, C. The ladies, the seamstresses have to put them together. It's like a, like a puzzle. Oh, okay. You know, but they have so much experience that they already know what goes where. And, uh, yeah, these people don't look like rookies yeah, that no, are no, here. Yeah, no, they've been here a long time. <laughs> Some of the ladies have been here over 20 years. So there's about four of them that have been here 20 years. A lot of them have been here 10, 15 years. So they've been doing this for, for a while. Well, that says a lot about the integrity of the company yeah. also. Yeah. When, when you don't have a t high turnover, mm -hmm. the people stay, yes. they're happy. Yeah, they're happy. They're happy. They're happy. They're, they're doing a job that they like. Mm -hmm. They enjoy doing it. Apparently, you take good care of them or they would go correct. somewhere else. Correct, yeah. Everybody that seems happy here, you know, they're all smiling. Everybody comes in, they smile to everybody like if they knew them, mm -hmm. you know. Like especially the wizards, like Julio said, that we welcome them to come and look at all the shop. They can actually watch them work, you know, watch them sew, and the ladies are all used to it already. They've been here so, so long, you know. So they don't mind us filming and they just taking all kinds of yeah, no. pictures of them and As you can see, they're they, smiling. Yeah, faces. we're still we're, we're talking with you guys. They're still working, you know. No, we're not bothering them. No, no. They're like I said, they're used to it. Yeah. They're they're going to gonna continue to do their job no yeah, matter what yeah, we do, exactly. huh? Exactly. That's good. Yeah. Outstanding. But then, okay, after she cuts the material, she, uh, she rolls it up in a little ball like this. Mm -hmm. These are all orders right there, all ready to go, and your person's name's on it. Then we take it to uh, one of the seamstresses. They unfold it, take all the patterns out. Now, you just made one of these ladies mad because they're going to have to redo all that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we take it out like this, we take it to the lady, mm -hmm. and they already know what goes where. No, Sweet. Just by looking at them, some of them are, are labeled, mm -hmm. but a lot of them have so much experience that they already know what goes where. So After them, 10, 15, 20 years, I think yeah. so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. They've probably forgotten more about this than most of yeah. us will ever know. Exactly. Eight hours a day, they, they're, they're at it. How, yeah. how many of these do they push out a day? We do about 120, 130 seats a day out the wow. door. Cut, sewn, assembled. And that's personalized, individualized. 120, 130 yes. seats a day. That's not your manufacturer. We're going to run it through an assembly line type thing. That's individualized seats. A lot of the seats are all ordered on the web. Yes. You know, we offer it on the web. So that if they can't come in as a write-in, they offer them on the web, and they get the same treatment. Like Julio says, they get one-time uh, uh, rework on them. And you can order them on the web. And all through this video, we'll, we'll put the website and phone number all throughout this. So check them out on the web. Their website is very user-friendly everything that you need to order your seat. If you just can't ride it in, if you want to ride in, it's a great ride out here. Beautiful weather, it's real cool people. It's worth the ride out here. But if you're in the East Coast somewhere, you're up north and you just can't make it down this way, check the website out and give them a call. They'll walk you through the whole process. Now we're in a different part of the factory and we're gonna learn about, what do oh, we have? Uh, this is a finished uh, seat cover. Yeah, it's already cut, sewn. Like I said, these people, are, they order on the web. They get to choose their, their logo color. Okay. We offer different colors on this for a spider seat. RT, the, we offer silver. We have a bunch of different colors, yellow, whatever color that you can think of we have. So this is the fin finished uh, seat cover right here. This is the whole thing. Yeah, Somebody likes spider webs. Yep. That's for a spider, the three-wheel bike that... Oh, that Can-Am thing. Can-Am, yep. Yeah. Can-Am spiders. We did test rides with Can-Ams the other day. Yeah. And as you can see, the Corbin emblem for the RT, the rally uh, for Can-Am. We had a great time with Can-Am running with those guys the other day. Uh, I don't remember where we were, but we had a great time riding all three of those. And uh, those bikes yeah. really run. They're popular. They're Real a lot popular. of fun. A lot of fun. Yeah. But the quality of the stitching here, I mean, that's, that's impressive. Comfortable material, and this is the whole thing. That's the whole seat right there. You need the base pan to assemble it, and we're set, and we're good to go. Nice about this yeah. is the back rack. And just in case you're not using it, you can cover this up, and that way it doesn't get water underneath it. 
and you don't get a, a wet, you, well, you can fill in the blank on that one. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna move around and see some other things, some, all the materials. Now we're in the section of the factory where you actually get to pick out the, the leather, the color of the leather that you're gonna have the seat built out of. Correct. You've got a wide variety to That's choose right. from. A lot, of, a lot of different materials we have. We have the gator, red gator. These are all stamped. You know, we don't use the real stuff because uh, real leather, you know, we have to kill a lot of animals for that. <laughs> so this is all uh, stamped leather, but real popular. Red, we have uh, all these different colors, ostrich. We have the bomber jacket, brown is the real popular one. That bomber jacket in black, it's also real popular. You see the distortion on it? Looks good. Yeah, these are all real good leather, quality leathers. Well, and the other thing is, if you use real leather, mm -hmm. uh, now that would present a problem uh, in time yeah. with the care of it. Oh, and yeah. if you're like me, I ride in all kinds of weather. Right. The rain, the sleet, the snows, and all that kind of stuff. Uh, and so a simulated leather, I, I guess that's the correct term that you'd use for it, uh, you don't have to kill all the animals. But it also is, it's a better enduring and, and a lasting it, product. It lasts a, a little bit longer than the, the real stuff. And it's more comfortable because a real leather on a bike seat uh, in South Texas <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> gets hot as Hades. And you don't, oh, we want real leather. Not in South Texas and it's 110 degrees in the shade if you can find any and your bike's been parked in the parking lot for three hours. Correct. Uh, it'll warm up the lower part of your anatomy quick. But here, you've got all kinds, of beautiful quality. It's all high quality today. If you, if you can't find the different quality of materials or the colors here, it probably doesn't exist. It probably doesn't exist. If they don't have it here, I don't even know where you'd go to find it. <laughs> exactly. We try to have as much as we can to offer different options for the, for the writer. This would match almost any custom painted bike or any stock bike on the market. Correct. Outstanding. Well, we've gone through here. We've seen the wizard. We've seen the girls that cut all the stuff out. We've seen the finished product that goes on there. You can pick the products out. What's next? Let's go see where we make the base pens. We're going to go see pans being made. <laughs> 